All right, look at this. Quick moving storm leads to flash flooding in the metro surrounding drivers in water. Uh, several had to be rescued. You can see that car almost fully submerged. 41 Action News reporter Andres Gutierrez joins us now live from North Shoto Traffic Way near North Belmont Boulevard. Andres, what's the scene like there? Well, Chris, the, the city has gone ahead and placed up these barriers after the fire department had to conduct two water rescues here. Despite that, drivers continue to go around these barriers. In the last hour, we have seen two other vehicles that have stalled out. They had to be towed away by good Samaritans who have stepped in to help those drivers. Now, we do have cell phone video of one of those water rescues that did occur this morning. The workers from a nearby business were yelling at this driver not to go through that high water. One of those workers is Joe Tanner. We spoke with him shortly after that rescue, and here's what he told us. Every time it rains, that heavy thing, mm -hmm. and the semis are coming through, and then here comes a lady in a four-door coupe, and we knew doggone good and well she wasn't going to make it, and we told her, no, don't do it, don't do it, and she come about halfway through. It started floating, ended up calling 911. Kansas City uh, Fire Department came out and rescued her. Now, another man, Jason St. John, shot this video of the actual rescue earlier in the morning. Witnesses say that fire crews had to pull out a woman and a child from another vehicle here on North Shoto, right off of North Belmont. Across the city here this morning, the Kansas City uh, Fire Department tells us they had to conduct 10 water rescues in total. Reporting live in Northeast Kansas City, Andres Gutierrez, 41 Action News.